Good morning, brothers and sisters. Let us begin our morning praise. Lord, open my lips. My mouth will proclaim your praise. Come, let us worship Christ, chief shepherd of the flock. Come, let us worship Christ, chief shepherd of the flock. Come, let us sing to the Lord and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us worship Christ, chief shepherd of the flock. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come, let us worship Christ, chief shepherd of the flock. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are his people, the flock he shepherds. Come, let us worship Christ, chief shepherd of the flock. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massa, they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Come, let us worship Christ, chief shepherd of the flock. Forty years I endured that generation. I said there are people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us worship Christ, chief shepherd of the flock. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, Come let, let us, us worship Christ, Christ, chief shepherd of the, the flock. flock. Loving shepherd of thy sheep, keep thy lamb in safety keep. Nothing can thy power withstand, none can pluck me from thy hand. I would bless thee every day, gladly all thy will obey. Like thy blessed ones above, happy in thy precious love. Loving shepherd ever near, teach thy lamb thy voice to hear. Suffer not my steps to stray from the straight and narrow way. Where thou leadest, I would go, walking in thy steps below, till before my Father's throne I shall know as I am known. You are the light of the world, a city set on a hill, cannot be hidden. O God, you are my God, for you I long, for you my soul is thirsting, my body pines for you like a dry weary land without water, so I gaze on you in the sanctuary to see your strength and your glory. For your love is better than life, my lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name, I will lift up my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed, I remember you. On you, I muse through the night, for you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings, I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. You are the light of the world, as a city, city set, set on, on a hill, hill cannot, cannot be hidden. hidden. Father, creator of unfailing light, give that same light to those who call to you. May our lips praise you, our lives proclaim your goodness, our work give you honor, and our voices celebrate you forever. Let your light I shine, shine before, before men, that they may see your good works and, and give glory, glory to your, your Father. Father. Bless the Lord, all you works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, 
bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Hananiah, Azariah, Mishael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven, praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. Let your light shine before men, that they may see your good works and give glory to your Father. God's word is alive, it strikes to the heart, it pierces more surely than a two-edged sword. Sing a new song to the Lord, His praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its Maker, let Zion's sons exult in their King. Let them praise His name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in His people, He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory, shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hand. To deal out vengeance to the nations and punishment to all the peoples, to bind their kings in chains and their nobles in fetters of iron, to carry out the sentence preordained, this honor is for all his faithful. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. God's word is alive. It strikes to the heart. It pierces more surely than a two-edged sword. Let Israel rejoice in you, Lord, and acknowledge you as creator and redeemer. We put our trust in your faithfulness and proclaim the wonderful truths of salvation. May your loving kindness Embrace us now and forever. A reading from the letter to the Hebrews. Remember your leaders who spoke the word of God to you. Consider how their lives ended and imitate their faith. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Do not be carried out by all kinds of strange teaching. On your walls, Jerusalem, I have set my watchmen to guard you. On your walls, Jerusalem, I have set my watchmen to guard you. Day or night, they will not cease to proclaim the name of the Lord. I have set my watchmen to guard you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. On your walls, Jerusalem, I have set my watchmen to guard you. What you say of me does not come from yourselves. It is the Spirit of my Father speaking in you. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands 
of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. What you say of me does not come from yourselves. It is the Spirit of my Father speaking in you. Christ is a good shepherd who laid down his life for his sheep. Let us praise and thank him as we pray. Nourish your people, Lord. Nourish your people, Lord. Christ, you decided to show your merciful love through your holy shepherds. Let your mercy always reach us through them. Nourish your people, Lord. Through your vicars, you continue to perform the ministry of shepherd of souls. Direct us always through our leaders. Nourish your people, Lord. Through your holy ones, the leaders of your people, you served as physician of our bodies and our spirits. Continue to fulfill your ministry of life and holiness in us. Nourish your people, Lord. You taught your flock through the prudence and love of your saints. Grant us continual growth in holiness under the direction of our pastors. Nourish your people, Lord. Now let us pray as Christ the Lord has taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Father, you made Peter Chrysologus an outstanding preacher of your incarnate word. May the prayers of St. Peter help us to cherish the ministry of our salvation and make its meaning clear in our love for others. Grant this to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Our Mass will start shortly. <laughs> 